Thierry Airy Honoré is rumoured to be getting himself a La Liga Icon SBC. It's going to be the prime version, this exact card you're seeing here. Hopefully it comes out today or maybe over the next couple of days. Either way, it is going to be available for you to craft very, very shortly. Still about 400k and I've not actually used this man this year. EA have absolutely done him dirty over previous years. The card looks decent on paper but he never lives up to the hype in game. As far as I remember being an Arsenal fan, there'll be some bias here, but this man was unbelievable. Absolutely incredible. Probably one of my all-time, probably my all-time favourite player that I've ever been able to watch. And uh, he deserves a better card. Hopefully next year, with the EAFC 24, this man gets uh, his little juice. Four-star, four-star, medium, medium though. Centre forward, left wing and striker. And the balance. The balance and aggression are really low. To be fair, I don't actually know if his balance is bad. Like, who remembers the goal against Madrid where he held off loads of players, kept up on the ball and still bagged it? I think they've done him dirty. That should be a bit higher. But the stats around that look decent. He's got the pace, decent agility, decent-ish dribbling stats. Composure could be a little bit higher. Same with the passing. I mean, he's a striker. Hopefully, you won't need to pass. You need to score goals. That's about it. We do have good shooting stats of finishing, attack positioning. But for prime honoree, should be much better. Finesse shot, he is known for opening up his body and pinging it in the far corner. So that is a nice little addition. And let's just see today how well this man hangs alongside the likes of the team of the season cards that we're getting at the moment. Rafinha's, Gabriel Martinelli's. It hopefully will be a similar price to Rafinha's SPC, maybe a bit cheaper. So we'll compare the two of them in game today. And I'm excited to try them out. If you are too, let me know down below. Have you used them already? Are you competing in the SPC? And let's get into the gameplay. All right, so Foot Champs qualifiers. Oh, Wrexham versus Wrexham. You love to see it. What kind of team is my man rocking though? Yashin in the sticks. He's got Nesta Alaba and some ridiculous red player picks. That's a very solid team, okay? Game on for the first one. Can the king do his bit? All right, not bad. Not bad dribbling. Oh, is he, is he giving me the goal there? I don't know. He kind of like he was playing for a second. I'm pretty certain that was a free goal, but still we dispatched it in style. Let's move on to the next one. I also realised that I've not actually given him the correct kit number. My bad for that little cameo there. 14 is on the back of the shirt now. Let's be having it. Ooh, look at the little pace there, boys. Doesn't look too slow, you know. Little step over. You could definitely feel like the lack of uh, cracked dribbling on the card, unfortunately. That is technically a little, uh, little nutmeg. But he feels a little bit slow and a little bit sluggish. Oh, well done. Trent, this could be big. Honoré's touch there, though. Just not ideal. Like, he just feels like he's a bit clumsy. Rafinha. Honoré. Footwork's decent. We do get it back to the big man, Rafinha. Let's watch his movement in the middle, though. Little ball roll here. That's it. Thierry. Swivels. Oh, he just gets too stuck in his own feet, man. That's decent, though. That is very nice. Honoré. Had to be. Had to be a goal. A little nutmeg again in there. He's bagging it for fun at the moment. Unfortunately, the strike didn't find the back of the net, though. Still, positioning's good. He's in a lot of space in the middle, boys. Ah, I thought he was going to play it across. Fair play to him. Royce gets the goal. Oh, boys. It seems like we're letting him score. What was Zinchenko doing then? And the keepers almost just said, you know what, mate? I'll let it go past me. You can have this one. Nice, Henri. Green time finish there, clinical. Movement's looking good. You know, I can't complain about that. Finish on the left foot, no complaints. Let's see if we can continue the fall. Henri, in the space. Come on, Amos. Come on, my son. Come on, up against Lucio. That little ball roll heel to heel seems to work. But in this situation where you're trying to do tricky dribbling, boys, he just feels too slow, man. Like, not cracked enough to make a quick turn, swivel on it and beat a player like a lot of the team of seasons currently can. Uh, Royce, for example, that man, perfect example. Dribbling's absolutely insane. It's so liquid. Uh, unfortunately, TT doesn't provide that. The Stegen actually making a save for once, which is nice. Up to Martinelli. Oh, mate. I mean, Alisson's definitely doing that for the cameras. But Gabby holding off of a whole horde of players there and then hits the woodwork. Honoré. Step over is good. He doesn't have the pace to get away from Lacroix. Like, Lacroix is quick and all. But you really don't feel like the stride with Honoré's card. Barely any acceleration as well. It's very controlled and very laboured, especially in the team of the season stage where every centre-back's got like 90-plus pace. 
He's getting a little bit swamped up there by himself, unfortunately. I mean, that's lovely. I don't know if we've actually meant to go down that alleyway, but it's worked out. Martinelli might be in here, boys. Kida Kaposia, pick him out in the middle. The return to sender. TT, number 14, gets the brace. And it is game on. All right, into the final few minutes here. Mbappe's come on the pitch. This is a card, right? You could somewhat take comparisons to Thierry Henry. Yes, they're both French. That's not what I'm on about, though. Uh, like, they're similar kind of body types. We've, we've had the winner, potentially, by the way. Uh, but Mbappe is a similar price as well. And Mbappe is heads and toes better, more meta, feels incredible on the game. It's just disappointing, man. I'm annoyed at how bad they seem to make Henri feel every single damn year. But a comeback is complete. Can we put the nail in the coffin and bag a fourth? So we do manage to clutch up and get that W, which is fantastic. 2-0 in foot champ. So to keep this short and simple, Thierry Henry, 400k coins. In my personal opinion, if you're trying to truly sweat, and play the game the way it should be played with the meta. Henri is not your guy. The main selling point for this card is nostalgia. Arsenal fans, myself included, getting to use the King Thierry Henry in your team definitely adds value to it. However, in game boys, being real and uh, just honest, he is not fantastic. The main strong points realistically are the movement, very good. Pace is there, nothing crazy though. The issue with the pace is the dribbling doesn't really follow suit. So he doesn't feel as quick on the ball, unfortunately. It could be the balance playing its role. Shooting wise, clinical. Very, very good in front of goal. Right foot, left foot, it doesn't matter. He should be able to bag goals for you. He's got a nice physical side as well, minus the aggression and the jumping. But it is what it is, a little bit unfortunate. The SBC price has to be cheap. Has to be cheaper than 400k. If it's anything over, it's not worth it. I reckon 300 to 350 is a fantastic price point. I'll be in the comment section down below discussing it with you boys when the SBC drops. If you enjoyed the video, smash a like on it. Comment and subscribe. Let me know what's up. Let me know how your day is going. And I'll catch you guys later.